saying goodbye to an awesome school. What is up my peoples? I am back with yet another video vlog and this time it's going to be good and sad at the same time. Let me explain why. This will be my fourth video vlog, and I am going to be going with Warren East High School, and we are going to WGI Finals. The sad thing about it is a lot of kids don't know this, especially the Warren East kids and a couple other kids from schools that I've taught, is that this will be the last year I will ever teach in this state. For those that don't know, I live in the state of Kentucky and I've been here for as long as I know. <laughs> Let's just put it that way. I felt years ago that it was finally time for a change and I like do a lot of feng shui in my home and I said why don't I feng shui my life you know sometimes you just gotta reset and just see what's out there you know I tell myself all the time I don't want to get complacent with certain things and after years over five to six years to be exact of planning thinking praying asking questions, visiting, all kinds of things. I finally made a decision to sell my house and move to another state and continue teaching and passing on the knowledge that I have and hopefully changing somebody else's life and just experiencing new things. Obviously, once this video launches, it's going to be out for everybody to see. And if you ever want to get in contact with me, um, I do have a website. It is www.1234downbeat.com. has information about me, some supporters of mine, a lot of uh, marching band and indoor percussion shows that I've written. I've got some, um, I got a team with me that have written some concert band pieces lots of, um, I've done lots of color guard editing and recently um, added on drill writers so spread the word and I do arrangements my friends do arrangements and we're just hoping to get some new sounds out there you know, kind of like everybody else but kind of do it our way so get a chance check out the website and hopefully you enjoy the music that we've created all Riley. hey y'all stop all that fighting i'm too high from Bless you. Oh, oh, you know what it is. Oh my God! Afra. Where are we going? Where's the bitches? Where's the bitches? It's so cramped in here. This is going on the internet. Oh, what's going on the internet? Oh God! Hi. It is. Oh, it's a new one too. You are not. She does nothing. In 1,000 feet, turn left onto Kentucky 1039 okay. South. Okay. <laughs> Just interrupt the video like that. That's so going in there. Dang, Siri. I 
Jesus, I'm like Cedric phone. <laughs> Clearly, her phone is more important than her. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, he didn't even do it. When the opportunity comes to seize your storm, you have to go after it head on. Sometimes the storm moves too swiftly and we miss our opportunity. But when that happens, we must regroup and we must rebuild. It's here. We won't let this chance go to waste. <laughs> oh, he slick. He's... Stupid. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
That is not regulation. Cedric Lavelle, who is the head instructor for the percussion. It's, it's real hard to put into words the bond that I've had with him. I've known him longer than this, but I've been with the Warnies group for over 10 years, about. And it, it's hard saying goodbye to the close ones. Cause it's almost like it's not ever just goodbye, but you know, man, it's like I'll see you later, you know. Because at some point, wherever I'm at, I'm going to either fly him to fly him to where I live or whatever. We're gonna always hang around, and always be around. But I just wanted to know, man, I love you, you my dude, and we go way back, and I will always be appreciative of you allowed me since the first day we started. We had, <laughs> it was so funny, I wanted to write the drum book. Um, the first year I was there, but sometimes, you know, some instructors are, you know, conscious about letting other people write for their own groups. So I, it was almost like I had to win over my own best friend. It's like, man, I got this, man. Let me write the book. <laughs> and even though I didn't get to write that first year I taught, he did allow me to write the second year. and. I changed up the technique and that we grew, the drum line got stronger. It was amazing to see that group and definitely will always be appreciative of you allowing me to be a part of such a great organization and I will always be thinking y'all, thinking of y'all in prayer and I will always be nothing but a phone call away might take me a little while to get down there if you request me to come in person, but never hesitate to ask, and I'm on the first flight out. 